with my fellow brick stackers. It's Chris, and we are getting ready to go into another discount store in a town that we used to live in about seven and a half years ago. Uh, so we're going to go in and check out and see if they've got anything here. We're going to hit two Walmarts and a Toys R Us before we head back out. So let's go inside and see what we can find. All right, well, we had absolutely no luck in that discount store. Um, there was like two toys all throughout the whole store. It's wiped out bad. So we're heading to Walmart now. We'll check back with you in just a second. Well, that was disappointing. We just went into Walmart, and it's an older Walmart, and this is a, a more of an upper-class town, but they still had a lot of the old Superman sets and stuff on there for full price. No clearance, not even a clearance at all. So we got another Walmart to hit in Toys R Us. I'm not sure which one we're going to first. Probably uh, Toys R Us. Uh, so we're going to go there now and uh, get your shoe down, boy. And we're going to head there now, and we'll check back with you in just a minute. All right, we're in the second Walmart. It's a lot of... A more upper class place, but I want you, I want to get TK, my son, to go around and just kind of scan the sets. The only things that are on sale are things that were on sale last August. Uh, for instance, here's the Attack of the War for $35. Uh, they still got Out of Black Gate full price. Unexpected Gathering is still $70. Bucks. Um, plenty of Simpson Figs full price. Uh, they got all the old sets. Rancor Pit still here. X Wing, ATT. Then you go up here, you've got all your big sets still sitting up here. Nothing marked down like we've seen at other stores. Turn around, you got the still the Green Box Ninjago still out. Uh, Bat Cave still sitting out. No, put that down. So we got all the old. Here's the Malibu uh, Mansion still at 40 bucks. So nothing is marked down. All the old sets. This is still sitting at 20 bucks, and we paid 11.50 for that and got it out at all the other stores. So very disappointing. We're facing it to Toys R Us. Hopefully, we'll have some more luck. Uh, we are going to look for a clearance section. They had one little clearance end cap down there, but it didn't have anything really worth it. So anyway, you cut up the camera off, buddy. Let's go look down here. Here's a bug obliviator. So it's, it's 49, <laughs> and we paid a lot less for that. We paid all the way down to 25 for this in other stores. So I'm not going to pay that for that yet. Anyway, we're going to cut it off and head over to Toys R Us. So we're we'll back in a minute. We're in Toys R Us, and this is a smaller Toys R Us, and it's a baby's Toys R Us split half and half, so really small. But found a few things. So first, we'll start off looking at these Technic sets. Found two of these. The seals have been broken, but I did look in there, and there's, everything's in there still sealed. But 8071, five or nine three pieces, is $22. Uh, and it parts out for over 60. So we're gonna go ahead and get this. And I got two of those. And I was able to find two of these. This is the 954 piece pickup tow truck, 9395. It's on sale for 40, no, 54, isn't it? Isn't that 54? I thought it was 40. 40, 44, I think what it is. Anyway, and, it, it, and I can get over a little over two my, times my money, it doubles up. So we're getting this for a 954 piece set. It's pretty good. And then found one the vampire castle and it's 54 that's the one it's 54 dollars 949 pieces 54 dollars and i got real lucky and i'm debating on whether to get the last ghost train down there for 49 dollars i bought a bunch of them that time at all 25 um but i'm really debating getting that one right there i've only got one for 49 i've got a bunch of them at the house already at 25 so i'm probably gonna wait on it that's 50 bucks i can put towards something else but i'll let tk kind of Scan the rest of the aisle. There's nothing else really on sale. We've gone through everything and scanned stuff. Um, really limited on what they have on Markdown. They, they do have the brown and green and blue tags on a lot of stuff, but not Lego sets. Don't have any poly bags out. So, looks like I'm going to get five sets and call it a day. And that'll probably be it for Brick Stack in the Wild. So, um, look at me up here. So, this is going to be it probably for Brick Stack in the Wild. We've gone to two Walmarts. Uh, the, the discount store and then ended up here at Toys R Us and did find at least five sets to make our drive worthwhile. So that's going to be it for Brick Stack in the Wild. And y'all watch me on Instagram, follow me on Instagram at Brick Stackers. Uh, make sure to like, subscribe, and share this video. And until next time, guys, y'all continue to stack those bricks. See y'all.